Hey guys! So today I just wanted to talk a little bit about cult classic and how I thought it went and how fun and all that good stuff. Uh, yeah, I'm just really lame. So let's watch this video that I made, which is like three and a half minutes long. It's not too long. It just gives you a little rundown, a quick rundown of everything that went through the weekend and all the panels and a little me who had a booth there right next to one of the best men, the nicest men I've ever met in my entire life, Paul Clemens. Um, there were so many, everybody was just so nice there. Uh, we were doing media there. My brother was doing all the photo ops. Um, his name is Josh D1301 on Instagram. Go check him out. He's a really, really good photographer. If you ever need anything and you're in DFW, hit him up. <laughs> okay, that was a really bad vlog and I apologize. Watch this video. <laughs>
my little video. Sorry. So that was my little video. <laughs> now I'm going to talk about it. Um, I actually enjoy Cult Classic. It is a smaller convention, but it has a lot of big names and big people there. A lot of uh, fun things to do. Like you can go outside and there's uh, live bands that play there. There's um, also vendors outside. There's It's like a whole... I, I wish I'd gotten more of that. I wish I'd gotten more video of that, actually. That would have been a lot better but I was very busy um but I did I, I enjoyed they had Porky's reunion there like almost the whole cast and they had um they had so many good names and I'll just let you go to their Instagram page or their web page and check all that good stuff out um but as for my experience there I had a really good experience there in fact I pretty much talked to everyone I know about it for like a week straight um it was just so fun and everybody there was so warm and welcoming and all the celebrities were just probably the sweetest um celebrities i've ever met honestly um i mean we had some cool stuff like there was the delta 88 which i huge fan and i got to um i got to do a little rewind okay sorry <laughs> and welcome back anyways uh yeah anyways so um i got to do a photo shoot with that which was really cool which you should check him out the guy that brought the car is paul real wheels on uh instagram check him out he's pretty awesome um there was some really cool cosplayers there some really cool cosplays to see all that good stuff i had a tremendous amount of fun being Baby Firefly, I did Ash Williams, and then I was just a little ghost face girl on Sunday, which was really fun. Um, it sounds like my daughter's, I don't know what she's doing up there, but she's having fun, so I'm going to let her go. That was like a crash. Anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I have ADHD. I'm sorry. Anyways. <sighs> okay. Um, but yeah, so Cult Classic, I would say, is definitely worth going to. It has a lot of history around it, too. So it's got some cool things to, to go and see and investigate while you're there. So I would definitely start looking into that kind of stuff. Like there is the gas station, which they also own. And they serve their barbecue there from We Slaughter Barbecue at the convention uh, uh the gas station which is the gas station from the texas chainsaw massacre the original and um so they bought that and they own that and they sell barbecue out of that how fucking cool but anyways they also have a lot of memorabilia horror memorabilia that you can purchase there there's just some cool sites to see like they have the van it's actually a replica it's not the exact van because that one i was told crashed and um so they got a replica and i mean it it's down to a t it's beautiful you should go see it nice photo up uh, and then in the front i mean everything just looks great you should really check it out um i loved it there and there's a lot of cool stuff like uh the campsites from friday the 13th i don't know for sure i have to look into that but i do know it is a campsite from friday the 13th that is also around there there's so many things that like horror fans would fall in love with. Um, I personally am going to do some research and then I'm probably going to go do some videos about it and go visit those spots. And if you have any spots that you think I should go visit, uh, let me know in the comments and stuff. I would love to go check it out. I love to travel. So let's, let's do this. I <laughs> had, um, a costume contest they had so many cool vendors they had people selling even like food and candy and stuff and that made me really happy because i love me some chamoy anything and they had a lot of chamoy candy and stuff that they were selling there which made me happy um and cookies uh but yeah so if you're in bastrop during convention time and you don't know what to do this is definitely something you should do i would also plan to go anyways it's just really fun they also have after parties at the hotel not too far from there um we were staying in that hotel and i didn't get to go to the after party because 
I was really tired and I'm lame and I pooped out and I went to bed. But uh, I did hear it was really fun and everybody had such a good time and uh, so that makes me happy. So overall I would say um, Cult Classic is definitely something I would suggest if you are a horror fan, especially if you're an old school horror fan. Um, I will show you a little bit of the merchandise I got that weekend. It was so fun. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm so lame and I'm sorry. So they have a website, they have a Facebook, Instagram, all that good stuff. You need to go check them out because they really do have some really cool people that they guest there and they have some really cool things that they do there. So, oh, oh, and one, one last thing. They had a shelter adopting dogs out. I almost took like two of them home with me, even though I know I shouldn't. I already fight with hair every day. I have two dogs, three cats, and a rabbit. So that would not have been smart, but I so wanted to do it. They were so cute and so precious. But anyways, if you are looking for a smaller horror con that's really fun and full of like, just tons of fun, you should check them out. It's a bloody good time. Well, I'm lame. All right. Have a good day. <laughs> Follow, like, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more awkwardness. Bye.